Hello everyone, this is Pippin Williamson with Pippin's Pages and Pippin'sPlugins.com and what I want to show you really quickly is how to list items from your custom post type um, and items from your custom post type that are filed within a specific taxonomy using um, another widget uh, that goes right along with the Easy Content Types plugin. Uh, and this widget that we're going to use is called Better Recent Post Widget Pro. This is one of mine available from CodeCanyon.net for $4. Um, you can see it's got a pretty good rating. Uh, so what we're going to do is we're actually going to use this widget in um, t in tandem with Easy Content Types to display uh, the post types that we have created. Uh, this widget's actually been designed exactly for this purpose. Uh, so let me kind of show you what I have. I have a custom post type called Books, uh, and you can actually see it right here. Here it is, Books. This is our archive, and we can see each of our post types, I mean each of our entries inside of this Books post type. And what I want to do is I want to display them in the sidebar or in this case any other widgetized area. Uh, it could be down here in the footer uh, or wherever else you have a, a sidebar. And also on this post type I have a taxonomy called genres. Uh, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to use this widget to first of all just list the entries from the custom post type. Uh, so I'm going to go over to widgets. I have the plugin active. It's called Better Recent Post Pro. I'm going to drag it into my sidebar and it gives us a variety of options. Uh, so first of all let's just give it a title called Books. And now we can choose the post title if we want to display it. We can choose whether we want to display the post author, uh, the date, etc. Uh, there's a couple other options. Let's just start with the post title. Um, and then also a post excerpt. The excerpt length in words, let's just say 15 words. And then we can choose a couple of options, uh, how we want to order the post, how we want to sort them, etc. And the number that we want to display, let's just say 5 for now. Um, and then there's a couple other options including thumbnails, offset, and the taxonomy to display items from. Um, and I'm going to show you those in a moment. At the very bottom, we have an option to choose the post type that we're going to display. And in this case, we're going to display books. Uh, so we choose books, and we hit save. And now if I go over here and refresh my page, I see books. And we've got the title as well as an excerpt for each one of them. Um, I can click on each of the titles and go to the full post, or the full book, excuse me. Um, so there they are. Uh, it's really, really easy. So this is a great way for you to display items in your sidebar, and you can do it in less than five minutes. Um, now, let's say that I want to display um, only from a specific genre. So what I'm first going to do is I'm going to go over to my books, and I'm going to go to my genres, and I want to choose the genre that I want to display. And let's say that we want to display the fantasy genre. OK, well, let's first of all take a look at the fantasy genre. Um, and this genre, uh, it has a slug of fantasy. Um, it also has an ID of 17. So let's go back over to our widgets and go over here. And let's choose a taxonomy, excuse me, a taxonomy to display the post from. In this case, we're going to choose genres and we're going to enter 17. Uh, that is the ID of the taxonomy term that we want to choose. And we hit save. Now, if we refresh over here, we see that it only displays the items that are filed under the fantasy genre. Uh, so you can very quickly uh, display very specific information. Uh, you can also display from more than one genre if you want. Um, let's say that we want to display from the fantasy and also the sci-fi genre. Well, this one, if we look in the bottom left-hand corner, uh, where we see the URL, we see tag ID equals 20. So we go over here and we enter comma 20, hit save, and now we have both of those genres displayed. Uh, this is the fantasy and also the sci-fi genre. So here we can click on Star Wars and there's our Star Wars book, all that information. So this which is extremely powerful, it gives you a lot of options. Um, most of all, it's really, really easy to use. Uh, you can have everything set up in less than five minutes. Um, it's extremely cheap also. Uh, like I said, it's only $4. Um, and will save you a lot of time coding or trying out widgets that you have no idea if they're going to work. Um, it's trusted. It, it works really, really well. And it has a lot of options. I mean, I only showed you two or three of the options, but there's quite a few more in here, including thumbnails, comment, date, author, etc. So anyway, um, I hope you take advantage of it. It's available from CodeCanyon.net. It works really, really well in conjunction with easy content types. Um, thank you for watching.